Hey, New Hope Church, it's Pastor Tim, and I want to remind you of a few things. It is Saturday, and it is time to spring ahead. That's right, 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. We don't want you to be late, which means you need to change your clocks tonight and make sure you spring ahead because it is that time of year. We're longing for spring, aren't we? Woo! Let's get there. Now, a few things about this Sunday. I am so excited. I am preaching tomorrow morning, and it's been two months where I have not preached. It, we've been on a sabbatical and walking through some healing with our family, um, things with our son Luke, and we are on the other side of that journey. Praise God. Hallelujah. And uh, at some point, you're going to hear a full testimony about what God did and, and how it's honestly what we've gone through is going to affect our ministry and what God wants to do at New Hope which is really awesome because we feel like God's really prepared us for a new season of ministry, which is really, really good. Um, so tomorrow morning I get to preach again and I don't want you to miss it because we are starting what I'm calling the road to Easter. Easter's coming up at the end of the month and uh, we're going through the book of Mark, but we're moving ahead to Mark 14. So Mark chapter 14, 15 and 16 is what we're using leading to Easter. And Mark 14 is so cool. The first, um, 20 something verses is what I'm going to be preaching on and it's going to be an experiential Sunday. Now, what does that mean? Well, I've done this in the past. So I'm going to actually preach in three different segments throughout the morning. So it's like a three part sermon and we're going to have times of response, times of worship. And in the end, we're going to have a very powerful, very personal experience in communion. Uh, because this is the passage where Jesus switches the Passover and institutes communion. And that is a powerful moment for us. So I would encourage you, be there early. Don't be there on time. Be there early tomorrow morning. If you need extra parking, it's up at Abers. You can use their parking lot. Um, and we'll we'll make sure that we've got seats for everybody to join us in worship. 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. Don't forget, spring ahead, change your clocks. And we would love to see you in the morning. God bless. Mm -hmm.